I know there's a lot of women who try to actually, you know, minimize um, their backsides, but I actually grab more weight when it comes to that. I feel like I do a lot of squats, a lot of lunges, and I try to grab heavier weights, sometimes 12, sometimes 20 on each side. Um, it does help bulk it and lift it up, and, and I always, I want a bigger booty. I want a bigger booty. So, you know, I definitely grab the weights when it comes to squats and lunges, um, and, I, and I do a lot of that. You know what, I have a sweet tooth. I really do have a sweet tooth. Um, I love candy, but I try to stay away, and I look for something sweet which is always fruit so if I'm craving something sweet at night I go for fruit I usually go for the berries that are sweet I love strawberries I'll, I'll pick up an orange I'll pick up grapes you know whatever as long as you have fruit I feel like you get that little bit of sweet crave out of you and you can and you can move on I'm pretty strictly weekends when it comes to alcohol I'm not really um, a, you know if, if someone comes by or we have company I'll, I'll always have a glass of red wine but um, I'm pretty much weekend drinker yeah, that's it. And as far as soda goes, it doesn't exist in my house. Um, we are seltzer drinkers. We all drink seltzer all day long. I cut up lemon. There's always fresh lemon in my house, and we drink seltzer with lemon um, all week long. I am actually trying to set an example. Um, my daughter sees me work out all the time. I have her in a lot of activities. She's in dance, and she's in gymnastics, and cheerleading, and she does all of this. And, and I like to show them that I'm healthy. Their father likes to show them that he's healthy, and, and through that, they'll see a healthy lifestyle and, and also want to be healthy. You know, when, when Antonia sits on the couch with a box full of donuts, I let her have some donuts, but I'm like, Antonia, are you going to eat the whole entire box? And she sees that maybe it's not good to sit on the couch and eat a whole box of donuts. I feel like if you allow that and, and teach them from a young age that it's okay to have some donuts, you're a child, have, have a couple donuts, but don't sit on the couch and eat a whole box of, of Entenmann's donuts, it'll start to teach them from a young age to awareness and to be healthy and and um, not necessarily to be skinny or to be perfect, but just to be healthy. I was about 10 pounds heavier than I am now when I first met Joe, and I even see the pictures from our honeymoon, and, and Joe's like, look at you, look a little thick there. But I, <laughs> I'm like, Joe, it's like five to 10 pounds heavier, but on me, it does look like I have some junk in my trunk. And um, yeah, it definitely is. Our honeymoon pictures, our, our you know, spending summers on the beach when I first met him, I'm like, oh my goodness. He's like, you were thick, you were a little. I was like, well, come on. He's like, you're a little bit thicker. And everyone says that as I had children, I got skinnier and skinnier after every child I had. And it was just weird. I don't know if it's because I ran around more and because, you know, I do, I have, I mean, I have a seven-year-old, a five-year-old, and a three-year-old. So, and, and you know, I don't have nannies running around my house. So I'm up and down stairs all day long. I'm back and forth to gymnastics, to cheerleading all day long with my kids. So I do think with every kid I had, I, I lost a couple pounds because you just run around that much more, you know?